Welcome back. Today it is Orchist, and we are going to be looking at some decks. Um, feel free to use them. This one you can use. This one we're going to modify. But this right here you can use. Goblin hut, goblins, those kinds of things. Okay. So we are going to be putting together this deck. So we're going to put in. We're trying to put in an even amount of everything. So we want two rares. I think I got those. No, that's that's an epic. Okay, so we have three epics right now. No, four. Okay, so we got two spells. We got two spells. And now, okay, so we have our two spells. We have this guy um, that if we get onto a tower, he will totally destroy it. We have this minion horde level seven so if somebody puts down like let's say a, a knight or prince um you can put the um the minion horde and the knight in front of them okay so we're going to modify this a little i'm going to put in the barbarians for the knight i'm going to put in the wizard for the Baby dragon. Then we are. Let's see. So we have our splash, our splash damage, our stuff for like princes. Um, I don't know exactly what you use that baby dragon. This for these two. No, you put that for prince. This would be for giant skeleton. Get this on tire, destroy it. And then these two spells would help corrode, and this one would help kill it. And then we're just bringing in those. Let's well, get the regular goblins back. Good. Put those in for the archers. Okay, so let's jump into a battle. Okay, so here we are playing king. Now we are going to start off. We're just going to put down our goblins in our spear goblin hut. Now he reacts with a baby dragon, so we know that he has that in his hand now. So we can put down the wizard on the other side. Oh dear, now I put down the hog rider. And of course he's got that. Let's put down the uh let's put down the minions over here. That tower. We've got the baby dragon. Oh, he's got those arrows, but he completely missed them. So we got lucky there. So now let's put down our barbarians. Barbarians are very helpful for against stuff like I see they just tore apart those. They're um, uh, just regular goblins. So right here, we got a good push. Um, what I was saying, they're good against units like princes because they have those, they have that big radius and they're very strong. Well, not radius. They're very strong and they have that wide attack range. So we had that good push. Let's put down another goblin hut. Well, I'm going to do a giant skeleton with the wizard. So, now let us get to full elixir. I was going to lightning that, but I can't now. Okay, so let's put our giant skeleton up there. Put down our wizard right there behind the giant skeleton. And then he put down his giant skeleton. Both the same level. That's just a draw. Well, not an exact draw. But that will the giant skeleton bomb will kill his and... Okay, now we, and then ours will kill his, and his will kill ours. So, right there, let's get another goblin push. Let's put another spear goblin hut down. And, uh, he had those arrows, so now we know that he does not have those. Okay, so he has the prince. I don't know why people use the regular skeletons. If you use them, good for you, but I don't really see the point of using them. Okay, let's put them... The poison spell. Spear goblins. Oh, he's gonna put he's gonna attack the other side now. So we're gonna lose all those guys. Let's just lightning that hog. Don't want to destroy that tower. So he has about half life. Now let's use these barbarians for a good reason. Okay, so now that see they just totally annihilated them. Okay, so now we're gonna put down our minion horde. Followed by, yeah, let's just leave them. Let's just let them do their work. 
So now I'm just gonna. I was gonna drop a lightning spell or a, or a whatever you call it, poison spell. So on his crown tower. So this. I don't know exactly what you call it, arena tower or something. So this did. That deck did really good. Now I could see some modifications. Okay, so right. I rarely use the poison spell. So let's take that out with the hog rider. Same cost. Okay, now let's do another battle. Now I'm hoping this guy. Oh, we're in the builder's workshop? Oh man. So. Oh, level 8. Okay, last time I played level 8, I 3 crowned him. Um, but other times, I just completely get 3 crowned. Let's put down the spear goblins, Wittered. Now let's put down our barbarians. He has level 8 barbarians, so they should be able to take ours down pretty fine. Rocketed? Seriously? Rocketed? Okay. So now let's put down our minion horde. They'll get probably one hit. Yeah, one hit. Now he used... Did he use... No, yeah, that was the last battle. But uh, he's putting a minion horde with a minion horde. Pretty evenly balanced, but he had that... um tower behind him so he beat ours okay so now those should go through pretty fast now let's put down our goblin hut wait didn't, no I didn't just take that out oh he's got the expo now no 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 expo not in my house the expo if it gets on your tower it will annihilate it okay so our forces are dead I think he has that tower no okay but Let's, I still got a chance here. Let's lightning it. Oh man, I moved it right out of the radius. That sucks. So, not the radius, the length, whatever you call it. Okay, so this tower is almost dead. That's really annoying. And now we are going to do a barbarian and minion horn. Two combos that are really good. Um, maybe I'll do the wizard. Uh, oh, I know what I'll do. I'll put the minion horn back here. No, the barbarian's back here. Put the wizard behind them. And then, yeah, he rocketed them again. Okay, so we'll put our spear goblins down. Now, let's... Okay, let's put down the hog rider. He's got arrows, which is really annoying. So, he puts down that minion horde, which will counter my um, hog rider perfectly. Let's put them... Right here, so that we have that tower backing him up. Let's put down the barbarians because I do not want him on my tower. So let's put down the wizard, another good unit. Let's put down the spear goblins. Oh no, will he get a? Yes, he will get it. So now let's put down the giant skeleton. Now, while they are destroying that, he will go down fairly quickly, but he will get all of them will get killed by the giant bomb. Well. Big bomb, whatever you call it. Let's lightning the inferno tower. Won't kill it, but it'll get do some good damage. Oh no, another one of those. He. Let's see. Let's put down that. Oh no, this is not looking too well. Okay, good. We took that down. No problem. Well, it was a problem, but it we got it down quickly. So a hog rider will go over there. Oh, he got past him, and he died. So let's put down our giant skeleton. Lucky for me, all those guys will get killed. Though I don't know why they nerfed him. The giant skeleton was awesome. But now he's kind of weird since they nerfed him. Okay, so we have to react to this fast. We do not want to lose. Okay, so we got that down. This is pretty even. can't believe I'm actually evening with this dude. Okay, so it's lightning that. I'll put my hog down. Then, well, let's hope that he does not have the. Oh yes, he has those barbarians, and those. Let's get the. Let's get that lightning spell back up. Um, these guys will all die. Oh, it's it's a draw. Okay, so we didn't get any trophies. We didn't get anything new, but hey, we did draw to a level eight player. If I had a little more time, I probably could have taken down his tower. Um, but. Um, uh, that uh, we didn't have enough time. Okay, so like this video if you liked it, subscribe, and see you in the next episode.